Good morning. How about that little Wayne? I love you, man. How about this undisputed? You are going to love it, man. How about them Cowboys? NFC Championship game, here we come, baby. Whoo! Good morning. This is the greatest morning of my career. This is about to be the greatest show I have ever been a part of. Welcome to the new Undisputed. I am about to introduce my new dream team of co-hosts. You just heard our new intro song from my brother, Lil Wayne, who will join me a little later in today's show to go inside the creation of this instant classic called Good Morning. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Dwayne Michael Carter Jr. And in just a few minutes, I'll kick off a new feature featuring you, your thoughts on the show, your tweets and memes on the show, we don't mind a little sarcasm as long as it's funny sarcasm. You can reach us at hashtag Undisputed Live. Now understand, I haven't changed one bit, but my teammates in format sure have. LeBron still has no clutch gene. Aaron Rodgers is still the most overhyped player in the NFL history. And my Cowboys will rise above middle of the pack Dak and Mike McCarthy. But now you get to hear from three of the biggest personalities in sports history. Are you ready? The time has come to introduce my dream team. First up, he was one of the biggest talkers and smartest players ever. Super Bowl champion with the Seattle Seahawks. Most famous member of the all-time great Legion of Boom. Three-time first-team first All-Pro. Five-time Pro Bowler. Yet he's best known for putting me in my place 11 years ago on ESPN. Wait, th th that's not right. Who's writing this stuff? Straight out of Compton by way of Stanford, Richard Sherman. Come on down. Skip! Richard! Come on now. Here we go. Come on. Hey, you knew this was inevitable. This was inevitable. I, I wanted you, and I got you. You got me. Next up, he was only the third receiver ever and the last receiver ever to be selected number one overall in the draft in 1996 by the Jets. He won a Super Bowl with the Bucks in spite of John Gruden. He grew up in the shadow of USC right here in LA. He starred for the Trojans, and he is an insufferable USC and Lakers fan. Oh no, another LeBron lover. The title of the book he once wrote was Just Give Me the Damn Ball. Well, I'm about to. Here is Keyshawn Johnson. What's happening, Whoa. Skippy? Whoa. What's up, sir? What up, baby? We good? Come on. Yep. Boom. That's right. We're going to have a little bit of fun on this show. Yes, sir. A lot Let's different than what fun. they think it was, I'm sure. Okay, here we go. And last, but definitely not least, as I've said many times, I believe this man was the greatest receiver ever. He was the leader, the rocket fuel of Dallas Cowboy teams that won three Super Bowls. Never. Has there ever been a more fitting nickname, The Playmaker? When it was time to play, 88 made plays. Trust me, I was there. Now he's about to make a whole bunch more plays right here on the new Undisputed. Out of the U and Big D, Michael Irvin. Out of you. Woo! Out of you. Hey, I am here now. Good to be home, too. Playmaker. Good to be home. Come on now, Playmaker. Bro, bro, skip. Skip, you know, I ain't got nothing but love for you when you say I'm the baddest man out there. <laughs> Let's just make it right, Skip. I don't care what they say. I love you, man. You say I'm the baddest love man you. out there. I got nothing but love for that man. Hey, you That's and it. I have been through a lot in and our We've been in that locker room. Yes, road. we have. We've been in that. Right. Let me just first say, I love that we are standing here all champions. As players, all champions. So we, we, when we talk, we all know what we're talking about and where we're talking from. We're talking from that stadium of a champion since we're all of that. Yes, sir. And allow me to say, 
it is surreal to be here with you three, but it is a distinct honor for me to be sitting amongst the three of you. So I appreciate all of you. I, I fought for all of you to be here, and it is a privilege and an honor to be with you. Yeah, it was a fight. It wasn't easy. <laughs> <laughs> That's for sure. I don't know about then again, we, allow uh, me to say, I'm actually afraid to ask the first question because I'm afraid once you guys start talking, I'll never get another word in on the, the rest of the history of the show. <laughs> It's going to be something. Okay, let's do it.